Reference is really a starting point to really understand and comprehend our type. But the type becomes even more useful when we really understand and explore the combinations of our preferences and how they interact to create our personality. You'll also notice when you look at the type table that it's organized so that similar types are next to each other and sections of the type table are organized in order to see qualities that are shared by groups or within the group of type. The INFJ is a personality type that is very intuitive. They tend to understand complex things as well as relationship. They do have a strong belief within their own insights, however, and they do understand the feelings and motivations of other people. Their dominant preference is an introverted intuition, which means we don't tend to see it very much. However, within themselves, they're likely to be very insightful, creative, visionary, conceptual, metaphorical, and even idealistic. They tend to have a very deep personality. Their extroverted feeling is what people tend to see the most, and this is based upon harmony. They need to have a deep commitment to their values, which are based upon an environment that is harmonious. They love to share their vision, and they tend to be very loyal to people and to organizations. Their tertiary function is thinking, and their less preferred function is an extroverted sensing. Career choice and interests are based upon the combination preferences of perception and judgment. For the intuitive feeling, they like to focus on the possibilities, what they can imagine, and even their innovations. They handle them by looking at the potential that others have, as well as being very insightful and enthusiastic. They love to have interests that are going to understand and encourage other people, as they like to play a role within society and contribute to its members. Some great careers for an NF are psychology, human resources, teaching, research, literature, religious services, healthcare, and even a career within art or music. Energy and the external orientations put together, which would be our extroverts or introverts with our judges or our perceivers, is really part of how people are going to respond to change. So our IJs are part of the decisive introverts. Now for decisive introverts, when they see changes or when they're first proposed, they're going to take those changes and they're going to start to check them out against their internal perceptions. Their internal perceptions being an idea, data, or a big picture. Now, if those changes fit with what they already think should happen, they're going to move quickly to implement them. However, if those changes don't fit, they will dig in their heels and become very immovable opponents to the change. The preferences within a personality type that include the judgment and the external orientations are what help to determine our leadership style, management style, and even a follower style. For the feeling and judging preference types, this is going to be a values-based decision maker. We tend to describe them as being warm and decisive leaders. They're going to make their decisions based on their personal values and empathy with others because they're going to strive for harmony. They need consensus and a supportive environment. They tend to be very expressive and even most inspiring. They're very, very loyal as a follower as long as their leader honors the values that they see. The preferences of energy and perception, which is our extroversion and our introversion, plus our sensing or our intuition, determines how we use information within our personality. An IN, an introverted intuition, would be called a thoughtful innovator. Their knowledge is important to them for its very own sake. The temperament for an idealist, which is an NF, an intuitive feeling. Now, when we look at that kind of temperament, we want to see that this temperament is an idealist. They search for a unique identity and meaning, and they value empathetic and meaningful relationships. They're generally very enthusiastic, and they want to make the world a better place for everyone. They trust their intuition and imagination, and they think in terms of integration and similarities. They focus on developing the potential in others and finding a purpose in life, as well as bridging differences. They need to be authentic within life. 
remember that the purpose of learning about our MBTI type and the, those dynamics is really to help us in understanding ourselves and to better build and to aid in developing our relationships with others. And this is accomplished when we look at the combinations of our preferences, the dynamics within our personality type, as well as the development and the growth that is available to our psychological type.